This is a simple two wire master to sub intercom station. And the way it works, if someone wants to call the master from the sub, they press the call button and all that does, it sounds a tone at the master station. They cannot talk to the master until someone at the master station presses the talk button and holds it down to talk. And now that's going through over to the substation and when they want to listen they just release the button and if you leave the talk button down now you can constantly monitor what's going on at the substation and if you no longer want to monitor then you have to hit this off button if the master station wants to call the sub all they have to do is press the talk button and start talking One of the nice things about this system is the people on the substation side never have to press a button to talk. So it is hands-free for them after they press the call button if, if they even need to do that. Of course, if you're monitoring, then um, they wouldn't even need to do that because you'd already know they're there. The master station has a volume control on the side, whereas the substation does not have a volume control. Wiring this system is very easy. Uh, it's got two terminals, one and E, and you want to make sure the one and E is connected to the one and E on the other station. So you just need to make sure, like this stripe wire on here is connected to the E, it needs to be connected to the E on that side. And then the only other thing is the power supply wiring connects to the plus and minus. Of course, plus is red, minus is black. Got to make sure that is correct and it comes with a little adapter for a plug on the end of the cable so you just got to plug that in there the system uses a two wire shielded cable and shielded means there's an aluminum wrap around the outside of the two wires going through it or it could be um, a copper braid or something like that around it and what that does is that isolates the cable from noise. So if you happen to run it near an electrical power supply or cable, um, then it could pick up noise if it's running in parallel to that. And the shield will block that noise. Now, however, if you're running a short distance, like here and this, we're just using a simple two wire cable, that should be sufficient. As long as you don't get any buzzing noise on the speaker, then it really doesn't matter and if you're not running it anywhere near electrical wiring that should not be an issue these units are both wall and desk mount capable for wall mounting you'll take this piece off and mount it to the wall and then the unit will drop down on it it slides onto it um, otherwise you just leave that in place and it's got some rubber feet for desk mounting